Welcome, in front of me is a Samsung Galaxy A30s and today I will show you how to transfer files from the device to an SD card or vice versa. So to get started we want to open up our file app which on this device will be called My Files right here. And once you're in there um, you want to navigate into your storage so let's go into internal storage um, now where your files are located may vary uh, for me I'm gonna check so there's a single screenshot in here and I assume photos will be on the SD card in this case uh, yep that seems to be the case so um, key thing to keep in mind photos and videos and screenshots that you have captured with the device itself will always be located under the DCIM folder and it looks like Samsung automatically saves them to the SD card if you have one inserted so that's why my photos are already on the SD card and the screenshot is still on the phone itself because it was prior to the SD card um, so that's where you can find all your photos and stuff like that now other things like download folder will contain anything uh, that you have downloaded using a web browser emails uh, they will all go into this folder and rest something like music uh, movies stuff like that are placed by users so you should probably you probably placed it yourself in there so you most likely know that it's in there so if you're looking for those specific things you probably know where they are um, but like i said photos and videos are always saved to this dcmi folder so once you find whatever that is that you wish to copy which for me i'm going to use as an example these photos right here i'm going to transfer them you want to select them so to do that hold one of them and it becomes selected like so and then just tap on the additional ones uh, simply like that now if you have an entire folder full of photos you don't actually have to select all of them by just simply uh, like tapping on them you can actually for instance go back to the camera folder where you can see there's the five items so those are the five photos uh, and select the entire folder along with all of its content and once it's selected you want to choose one of the options right here so you have move or copy uh, copy will just create additional set of uh, those uh, five files and you can place them wherever you want and the original ones will stay here while move will completely remove them from here and move them to a new location so I'm gonna choose move for this purpose and then you want to navigate to where you want to move it so I'm gonna move it to the phone so because right now I'm on the SD card so I want to move it in a completely different directory so internal storage as an example and then tap on I'm just going to a DCMI folder just to keep it organized and in the same place but it can actually go anywhere you want so you could go into movies and place the photos in movies if you want or you can even create your own new folder right here so create a folder and you could just name the folder whatever you want and then place the photos in there but like I said I'm gonna keep it organized so I'm gonna go back to the DCMI folder and move it here and this will add the camera folder into a DCMI and you can see that all the uh, photos are in here and the screenshot is also still here and if I go back to the SD card you will see that the photos are no longer here this area is completely empty now that's because of the choice I have picked so that is how you remove uh, photos videos or any kind of other file and if you found this video helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching